and welcome back to my channel where today we have another rebirth for you unboxing where i'll be unboxing one booster box as well as the queen's quest trial deck over here and uh, i've been watching quite a lot of stardom recently and queen's quest has been uh, one of my favorite factions that i'm watching besides donna del mondo queen's quest is actually my uh, close second favorite faction um two of my favorite wrestlers are azumi and uh, utami and I think their matches have been really, really stellar, especially those uh, def title defenses by Azumi for the High Speed Championship. And that's why I decided to pick up Queen's Quest as my second deck for this game. So uh, I've already got my um, Donna Del Mondo deck uh, up and ready. And this trial deck for the Queen's Quest is going to help me get all those starting pieces. And uh, let's take a look at the cards. Like the previous unboxing, the top half of the trial decks are actually the same cards. We are more interested in the second half of the deck, which is focused on the faction itself. So we won't really look at the top half over here. And as you can see, um, they are all duplicate cards that we have on the other trial decks. We've got Momo, Azumi, um, Odeotai, Starlight Kid, yeah, Shuri. Tam and Mina, yeah, so uh, all these are actually the generic cards that you can find in all the other trial decks. And this is the second half, where it's like the Queen's Quest exclusive. Here we got Momo Watanabe, who actually is part of Odeo Tai now. We got a one cost Azumi, a five cost Utami. And that's like the green cards, the blocker cards. And oh dear, I can't remember her name, but she's the phoenix who does the phoenix splash. Ah, suddenly can't remember her name. And that's one of the twins, I think it's Hina. And here is the Queen's Quest uh, faction card. And we got a foil uh, Mayu from Stars. We got a foil Queen's Quest Azumi, the one coster. And we got a foil faction card for Queen's Quest. It looks like uh, we're not luck not as lucky as the previous uh, unboxing where we actually put one of those uh, promo uh, partner cards but um, nonetheless it's been uh, it's been a good pull I have to say especially getting that four affection card that always you know it's a nice pull and now we're going to unbox the booster box and there are quite a lot of cards that I'm looking forward to besides uh, getting all those um, triple R cards for both of my factions Donna Del Mondo and Queen's Quest uh, my friend is actually going to be playing um, he's playing Cosmic Angels and I think he's also going to start uh, Odeo Tai soon uh, that will be Shu my friend and here we have um, I think there are a total of 10 booster packs slightly smaller when you compare to those American card games and yeah so uh, let's take a crack at the first one been a long time since I actually opened booster packs and there's a nice cutting on top so it's easier to open and yeah so we're looking for Donna Del Mondo cards as well as Queen's Quest and here we have Unagi we have a stars card a stardom ring announcer and we got a first um, go bordered triple R card and a foil stars and this uh, Cinderella Journey Rebirth card yeah uh, Saya yeah with Saya and the Wonder of Stardom Championship which is the white belt on it so uh, if I'm not wrong these uh, go border cards I think you can only pull maybe one per booster box or two and um, yeah got an Odea Tai one so hopefully I can trade that away yeah, here we have Waka we have another ring announcer, we have another Deo Tai, can't remember their name still, we got Mayu, we got Tam Nakano, another go border card, and this is a Super Wars uh, Rebirth Cancel card. So we already got two go border cards, uh, I think that's really good, <laughs> because uh, from my knowledge I thought there will be only one, so uh, pulling two will be good. And here we go, uh, yeah, we got no other duplicates, I, I don't see any duplicates. So here we go with our third booster pack. It looks like we got another blocker card, 
which is uh, Mayu. Looks like we're seeing her in every booster. We got Momo Watanabe. We got Fukugan Def. We got a ring announcer. We got a foil Tam Nakano. As well as a Nagoya fight. And this nice, nice foiling. Let me actually take all the foil cards and put them aside. Uh, okay, nothing left. So we go on with our next booster pack. So I'm really hoping to pull the uh, Gold Border Julia or the Gold Border uh, Yutami. You've got. Uh, that's a uh, Yutami, and I think that's Hina. Got our stars. We got Mika. Donna Del Mondo. Yeah, and the uh, Stardom uh, calendar, <laughs> calendar poster, which is uh, the Starlight Kid on the poster itself. Looks like all those rebirth cards are posters or the faction logos. So we have uh, Odeo Tai, we got Mina, we got Unagi, got Hina, got another Odeo Tai foil, nice foiling, and we got the Wonder of Stardom Championship, the white belt, which is like the Intercontinental Championship equivalent. So that's uh, our first title belt card that we actually pulled in our booster box. And we've got, um, we're down with our fifth pack right now. And that's Hemika. We got a Starlight Kid. We got a Waka. Momo. Stars. And the Trios Belt. Um, the Artist of Stardom. Nice tree belts, each with their own colors. I think it's a very beautiful set of belts. I always want Trios Belt to be brought to AEW Wrestling because there's so many awesome trios like the House of Black. And seeing these uh, trios bell defended in uh, stardom makes me really want them in AEW. So we got a Shuri, we got a Saya. Oh, oh, looks like we got a foil. Uh, we got a Natsupoi, one of my favorite wrestlers. We got a Deotai, and a promo uh, partner card for Mika. It's a really really nice card. So uh, I've also got a Julia from the Trial decks that will. You know, pair with this card nicely. And we're going on with our next booster. And uh, now speaking about it, I think it's those uh, special foil card, uh, special partner cards that you only get one per box. And we got a Natsupoi. We got a Starlight Kid. We got a Hemika. We got a Mina. We got a Four Stars uh, faction card. And we got the World of Stardom. This is the main title, the Red Belt. The most prestigious title in the Stardom. Um, and now we have two boosters left. Looks like uh, we already pulled two of the gold border cards, uh, one of the four partner cards. So uh, still fingers crossed. Um, here we have a chibi version of Tam Nakano. We got Fukuken Death, Stars, and Shuri, who has just formed her own faction, which is the God's Eye and a Rebellion Rebirth card. And now with our very very final booster, we've got nothing left unfortunately. This is uh, quite a fast unboxing for a card game with only 10 booster packs. Um, I really want to get another booster box. So here we have the ring announcer. Fingers crossed. Hope we still get something good. We got another stars card. We got a Azumi and one coster. We got a stars. I think we got a foil version just now. And we got a gold border Utami. One of the two cards that I actually wanted. And here we have the Rebirth Queendom. And I'm so happy to pull this, um, especially just starting um, the Queen's Quest faction. I'm uh, really happy to actually be pulling these um, Gold Border cards. And I believe this Odeo Tai and uh, Cosmic Angels will be easy trade for me with my friend. And I'm so happy to actually be pulling Utami when I just started uh, Queen's Quest. Um, yeah. So I'm going to need a lot of duplicates of these cards.